setting up an alarm is an easy job on an iPhone. But what if the alarm volume is too low that you miss it, or too loud that it scares you? Worry not, as in this video, we will be fixing this exact problem for you. Before we proceed, it's important to get some things out of the way. DND, or Do Not Disturb mode, and the ringer silent physical switch won't affect the alarm sound. Your alarm will still ring at the set volume, even if the two settings are on. So let us now move to the solutions. First of all, you should restart your iPhone. It is quite possible that a glitch or bug could be causing the alarm to not ring properly, and a restart often fixes those bugs. So you've restarted your phone, but still can't get your alarm to work properly. You need to check the alarm volume as the next step. Also, the alarm volume cannot be changed with the volume buttons unless the Change with Buttons is enabled in Sound Settings. For that, open Settings and go to Sound and Haptics. Use the slider under Ringer and Alerts to adjust the alarm volume. If you want to change this volume in the future using volume buttons on your iPhone, enable the toggle for Change with Buttons. The next thing to work upon is the alarm tone. It could be that the tone you have set is actually quite low or loud, so changing it might solve the issue. To change the alarm tone on iPhone, open the Clock app and go to the Alarm tab. Tap on the Edit option at the top left corner. Tap on the alarm that you want to edit. Tap on Sound and choose a different notification tone on the next screen. Hit the Save button at the top to save the changes. Next, if you are using the Sleep Wake Up feature, earlier known as Bedtime, on your iPhone, it comes with an alarm volume of its own. You will need to check if the set alarm volume is according to your requirements. To do that, open the Clock app and go to the Alarm tab. Tap on Change next to the time present under Sleep slash Wake Up. Once you scroll down, you will find a volume slider under the Alarm options. Use it to change the alarm volume. One of the features responsible for low or loud alarm volume on your iPhone could be the Attention Aware feature. Do note that this setting is available on devices starting iPhone X or later. To turn it off, go to Settings, then go to Face ID and Attention. Turn off the toggle for Attention Aware features. If you are using third-party alarm apps, then it might be possible that they are interfering with the default alarms on your iPhone. In that case, uninstall such third-party apps and see if the issue gets resolved. If the alarm volume issue is happening with a particular alarm only, try recreating the alarm from scratch. To delete an existing alarm, go to the Clock app and then tap on Alarm. Swipe on the alarm that you want to recreate or change, and then tap on Delete. Now tap on the plus icon at the top right corner and create a new alarm. See if doing this resolves your issue. It can also be possible that a bug in the software update installed on your iPhone is messing with the alarm volume. In that case, you will need to update your iPhone. For that, go to Settings, General, and then go to Software Update. If an update is available, your iPhone will notify you. Install it. Finally, if everything fails, then you will need to reset all settings on your iPhone. To do that, go to Settings, General, Reset, and then tap on Reset All Settings. Please note that doing so will revert all the customized settings to their original values. Hopefully, you are now able to successfully solve the alarm volume issue on your iPhone. If you like this guide, make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials related to your everyday technology. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.